Good morning, everybody. Scout is very upset with me this morning. So Scout is upset with me because I have got the little car loaded up and she saw the suitcase and she knows what that means, but I'm going to California for the weekend for our cousin's celebration of life. So it's a little bit difficult for us both to go to different things right now. It's also a lot more expensive. So Ed went to Cal Catalina for his sister, so I'm going to Irvine for our cousins. So I've known her since I was like 12. Um, she was really more like a sister to me. She was a bridesmaid in our wedding. So I'm just going to go for the weekend. A quick uh, turn and burn, as we call it. It's super early. It's super cold. Let's see here. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. I don't have my glasses on right now. So it's 37 degrees and 6.35 a.m. So I want to get an early start in case there's traffic. So first stop is Kingman um, to go to the car wash. And also, uh, me and Ed both recently have run into kind of a headache trying to get coffee at hotels. It happened to me when I went to Oregon in May, and he had some trouble uh, in Catalina in July. So I ordered a pour over, one cup pour over, um, and I'm gonna pick it up at an Amazon locker in Kingman so that I can have it in my hotel room. So um, yeah, I don't wanna have any coffee difficulties on this trip because I'm tired. Okay, first stop, Kingman Car Wash. I don't know if you can see those four giant holes in this where it used to be a puddle here but that's where Jeremiah's truck got stuck on the night of the vow renewal. We'll hold the camera up maybe you can see. <laughs> it's just four giant holes. <laughs> and this is what a couple weeks later? That's funny. <laughs> These guys. And I just turned down this road and this bowl is here. Oh, I think it's a bowl. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go right by him. I hope he doesn't mess with me. He's staring at me. I don't want any trouble, buddy. I don't want no trouble. Dude, he looks mean. Holy shit. Okay, that was a little intense. 6.45 a.m. I'm standing on the edge of a cliff Realize there must be more to life than this Reaching for the stars Traveling so far Like a dragonfly Just grab my hand From him sin With me tonight Yeah, coffee. I didn't make it very far. I'm just in Williams. I need coffee. Bad. Alright, here we go. Large. Yep. Boom. Okay, I've made it to Kingman, which is good because I'm already getting sleepy, so I'm ready to take a break and walk around, maybe have a snack or something. Um, all right, I'm going to run a few errands and hit the car wash. Is very dirty. 
Here's the before picture, before the car wash. It's bad. <laughs> looking cleaner that was worth it it was pretty quick too only eight bucks Okay, I'm so excited I got my coffee pour over. There will be no coffee crisis this trip. <sighs> what a relief. All right, time to get real serious about this drive. I think I got about 300 miles to go. It's 1037, we're up to 67 degrees, so that's good, it's been very cold. All right, let's do it. Okay, I made it, thank God. So it just took me like two and a half hours to go 60 miles. So I'm really glad to be at my hotel. It's like 94 degrees here. So I'm gonna go get settled in, take a shower, eat, sleep, all that good stuff. All right, later. So one of the reasons I stopped in Kingman was so I could get some crazy blue. Um, Sherry's thing was this blue and black uh, butterfly. I forget what it's called, but I was trying to find some kind of butterfly that's similar that I could sort of wear to the celebration of life tomorrow. So I've super glued some butterflies to these clips and I'm gonna see if I can turn it into something that looks okay to wear. I guess we'll see tomorrow. Okay, so it is the day after the celebration of life and I'm very, very tired, but I decided to get up early and drive down to the beach because it's only eight miles from the hotel I'm staying at. So um, I decided to come down to Newport Beach and watch the sunrise. 
before I drive for 500 miles. <laughs> I'm actually so tired that I might have to break up the drive over a couple of days. So we're going to see how it goes. I'm going to gauge how I feel when I get to Barstow. So, all right, off to the beach.